potential manipulation going to happen here? And then maybe SMT. We'll see. We'll see if it does this. I mean, I would be totally fine with this, like I said. Yeah, now we have this SMT here. SMT. This could be the start of the shift. Sitting in drawdown, but it's totally fine, like I said. I went early in case it wanted to go during lunchtime. Well, I got in at like 12.50, towards the end of lunch. But so far it did, it did re react there really well, so. Here's to seeing what happens here. It really should um, pick up from here. Especially there's two minutes left in this 15. I would not like it to really close below any kind of previous 15 minute, ideally. Get bought up now. We ideally start seeing structure shifts back up to the bull side and we start seeing more bullish order flow. Here's 130. Really, really ideally we don't have. We already had the manipulation in my humble opinion. Ideally we don't do this bullshit. We come back above and we hurt all these people that have been shorting since here. These people short, 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 short resistance. Definitely going to shoot through this. Not definitely, but most likely. Most likely. Yeah. So, yeah. also said so previous 15 minute the candle did not close below on NQ. I think this we're looking just fine. Um, been kind of annoying kind of holding this trade forever um, for about 30 minutes around break even, small drawdown. Totally not invalidating my thesis though. Totally still worth it to hold. And we'll see. All right, let's have an alert for when NQ crosses up here. Ideally, ideally huge like break above this and then everyone's gonna be off sides and then whatever, buy breakouts and whatever they wanna do. Really ideal. We just wick it, then I'm in some trouble. And I'd want to see what it, like the 15 minute candle close. Essentially just want it to close above, like this one, yeah. Oh. Wake up! It's finally waking up. Finally. Now let's just shoot up, like, everyone, I'm in position, I really just want rocket ship. Rocket ship time. Retail resistance gonna get blasted right now. Uh, after NQ hits this, I really don't want it to return at all. It should just go straight up, honestly. There's been enough accumulation. We had the manipulation. Let's have distribution, right? Accumulation, manipulation, distribution time. So actually, yeah, I think I can put my stop lower now. This 15 minute candle should definitely be green and closing above this one. Let's go. Okay, now rocket ship. All right, my stop is going to be moved up on ES now for sure. I really need this to plow through in the next few minutes. You know, on the 15, which is fine. We have nine minutes. But like, just watch how these candles go. If we wick it, it's gonna be trashy trash we'll see how this 15 minute candle closes i got killed i'm gonna get killed maybe i don't know i'm, I'm break even right now but this does not look great never mind i'm done three pdras fail your ass is next my yeah it's fine to have my stops there it's totally fine to trail my stops there we broke an intermediate term high here Low is now there, this is low, yeah. My stop is at the SMT. On the 15 minute, if this doesn't close above the previous, I'm out then. We'll see in five minutes what's going on here. But we really need to get bought up here and make new highs here, like now. I hate how this candle is closing. 
really needed the rocket ship and it wicked. No bounces. Trash this is, this is such trashy action. I don't think there's any reason for me to stay in this trade anymore. There's no chance. There's no reason. I need to cut it. It should have started rocketing and everyone being off sides. Now it's not. It's just not worth it anymore. It's... Nah, I need to cut it. I need to cut the trade. It didn't, it didn't go continue, so... I'm cutting it for a uh, negative two points. That was so annoying, but I'm glad I took the time stop. There's no point anymore. Um, yeah, no point. Cause I'm glad I, I'm glad I stopped. Cause look, this, this freaking resistance here wicked it. No good. We stopped. They didn't buy time. That's honestly scary. Something's happening. Yeah, the close was fine. I really had to convince. It's so hard for me to take those time stops. But yeah, I wasn't respecting this anymore. And I closed it so... It's right on time. So scary. Phew. Honestly. I get two points on ES is fine. I had plenty of time to do it too. I was arguing with myself. Rejection, reje this rejection really made me. I was really like, we need to invert this because we just inverted this. That was a nice displacement. You know? Um, and I waited one, two, yeah, two more minutes and I saw, yeah, it's wicking, it's horrible. Holy crap. Oh, I'm very, you know, good for time stops. And also I would have had my, you know, stop tighter. So it would have been okay. Um, nonetheless, do you see this craziness here? Just a flush. No, nothing. Something's happening. I feel like something in the world might have be happening right now where, is there any kind of news there? I don't have any more thoughts on the rest of the day. I'm just going to step away here. Really, no reason for me to. Oh, well, that's fine. Took this sell side in the morning, plus about nine points ish here, and the rest plus three, and then here just took off negative two. So, totally good on the day. I have no desire here to do anything. This is a nasty 15 minute candle to the downside. Nasty. Nasty. Honestly, thinking I was bullish, and honestly, I played that very well. I don't care. It's very well. Thank God. Holy crap. Just this close was on NQ and this one on ES. Unfortunate, you know, when when there were SMTs at the high then, and that was it. That's it. I'm not really interested in anything else. I'm done trading for the day. Maybe tomorrow we'll see something better.